how to set up your uh, your self-hosted server, right? So this is the first part, which is the the router, right? How to configure your router? So uh, first, you go to this address here, 192.168.0.1, which is the same for every router. You you must navigate to it from inside uh, your local network, right? For it to be available. And then you can access your router page, which in my, in my case it is this page here. So you just uh, fill in your username and password, which uh, these credentials should be present, like uh, in, uh, sticked in a label to the side or to the bottom of your router. Then you can find this and then you just log in. Yeah, and it, then you should look for an option called port forwarding, right? So if I, in my case it's here in advanced, uh, so port forwarding, and then I need to uh, forward the ports that I want to access from outside. In the, for example, we want to access it from Cloudflare, right? So the port I want to add is port 80, so I just click add service. Then I could name it like a HTTP port, something like that, and then uh, then it's port 80. I'll just do cus uh, custom so we can. S uh, see it more detail, right? So, for example, you have a range of internal ports you want to map to. So, in this case, I want to map ports 80 through 80. So, it's just port 80 uh, from the external, the internal to the external, right? So, this range 80 to 80, internal to this range 80 to 80, external, right? So, this is all you have to do in most routers. But in my router's case, uh, it as a it adds an extra layer of security that it asks you to specify uh, which which uh, which device is gonna you're gonna forward the port to, right? For example, this will only work for one of my connected devices and not all of them, right? For example, if I click here, connected device, I can find the list of connected devices, right? So my MacBook Air internally is identified by this IP. IPv4 address and uh, by this, this IPv6 and then I can add it just click in here and click add yeah so it added the IPv4 and IPv6 address for me and I just click save right please input a service name yeah so I just put my, my macOS server something like that right and then save Yeah, so it's saved. So you can see now that the ports are open. Uh, and yeah, you can check. Uh, you can ch use, usually check if you go to this this thing here, sportchecker.co. Uh, you can check your if you can access your port uh, from an external address, right? It's uh, portchecker.co to check if your ports are open uh, to the external world. Uh, so, for example, if I just set here some port like 443, it shows port 443 is open because I already set up port forwarding for this port, right? Uh, if I try 80, even though I set it up already, uh, let me try it here real quick. It shows port close. Um, this is some extra protection here somewhere. I'm not sure how this works, but... If you try to make a GET request to port 80, it will work, right? So it will also work with Cloudflare. Uh, but yeah, just to check if uh, the port forwarding is working, we can add some other port like 443 and check it. And in this case, it says it's, it's open, right? 